this is the first time we've done this. Um, last time it was just ceramics, but this time they were kind enough to expand it to other um, crafts. As you can see, we have woodworkers, have all of these other crafts here. So I think that was a great idea, especially with, with COVID, so we can have it out, outdoors, so we can have more people. We do have a swap in the fall, which is scheduled for September 18th, and people bring their unwanted fabric, yarn, notions, whatever it is that you don't want anymore and we'll take it and somebody else will want it. So when when I started at the society all I did was make baby afghans and as a result of being a member of the society I was encouraged to try new things. So this was one of the things that I was encouraged to try. So these are stuffed animals, they are all crocheted and there will be more coming because I can't just I can't stop making them. I just keep making them and making them. We I also crochet um, shawls so it isn't just critters. I hope that all of these guys go to good homes, that somebody will love them and play with them and treasure them. I have been uh, doing pottery for six years and uh, I hope to keep doing it for the rest of my life. I like throwing on the wheel, you know, like clay in my hand and being able to form it into something. I don't do very well with the trimming and the glazing, but that's part of it. <laughs> I, I do ceramics, uh, I make ceramics, and I have bowls, and uh, I, I'd like to make these little dishes for jewelry, or if you have like a little bit of something, and I do it all here at LexArc for about six years. What I like about ceramics is that it's uh, it's a little bit of everything. You're, you know, starting from the material, you're building it, then you're decorating, you're glazing it. I mean, there's so many steps, and each step is is kind of like a, a tightrope walk. It, you know, you have to get a little further, a little further, and finally, at the, at the very end, um, it's very satisfying because. If you've made it through everything, then you, you have a nice product. You have something beautiful, hopefully. Jewelry and photos, yeah, and I make some things, I uh, make a lot of jewelry from my photos. Everything over here, uh, with the exception of these flowers, are um, photographs that have been transferred onto polymer. Well, I kind of specialize in reflections. So I, I love nature in general, um, but I, I just love reflections. It's sort of a, it's, it's a reality, but a little bit different, <laughs> a little bit distorted, yeah. I feel, like, I feel like it's more my creation when I take the, uh, the reflections rather than just straight photos.